As a Yorkie owner, you probably have a lot of questions about your Yorkie. One of the most common questions people ask is, how big is a full-grown Yorkie? As a toy breed, Yorkies are typically very small but their size can range a great deal. Many owners of Yorkshire Terriers can be concerned that their dog is too small or too large when compared with other Yorkies. If you're concerned about the size of your Yorkie, you may be concerned about health issues or even if your pup is actually a Yorkie or perhaps a mixed breed. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The Secret Training Technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. How big is a Yorkie? The AKC, American Kennel Club, had previously listed the minimum weight of a Yorkshire Terrier as 4 pounds, 1.81 kilograms. However, breed standards have since changed, and now there is only a maximum weight of 7 pounds, 3.17 kilograms, for a Yorkshire Terrier full-grown. Regardless of this change, most Yorkshire Terriers find themselves fitting within the 4 pound to 7 pound range. Any Yorkshire Terrier full-grown that is smaller than this would be considered too small and find themselves with an increased risk of size-related health issues. These very tiny Yorkies are known as teacup Yorkies. It is not uncommon, however, to find Yorkshire Terriers growing to weigh around 8 to 10 pounds, 3.62 to 4.53 kilograms. This comes down to bone structure and whether the pup is overweight. A large Yorkie can also be the result of an incorrect pairing of dam and sire that were not quite able to produce standard-sized Yorkshire Terriers. The average size of Yorkie puppies there is so much growth in the first year of a Yorkie puppy's life. While for some growth will be spread out evenly over the course of the first year, others will see growth spurts with incredibly fast and noticeable growth for some months, and seemingly nothing for periods of time. Regardless of how your puppy seems, whether it looks overweight or not, under no circumstances should a Yorkie puppy be placed on any sort of diet, nor should they be over-exercised. It is absolutely and completely the norm for puppies to have puppy fat, making their appearance seem somewhat round and chubby. This is totally to be expected and nothing to worry about. How big can Yorkies get? On the other side of the coin, there are many owners who've grown concerned that their Yorkshire Terrier may have become too large. While you may be expecting your Yorkie to fall somewhere around the 4 pound mark, remember that the American Kennel Club standards account for a weight of up to 7 pounds if you want to bring them into the show ring. So this in turn means that there are many, perfectly healthy purebred Yorkies running around at 8 to 9 pounds or even more. Remember, these things cannot always be planned for. In every litter, there will be a variety and range of body structures. While you can look to the dam and sire to get some idea of how you can expect the puppies to come out, genes as far back as 5, 10, or more generations can reveal themselves and play a contributing role in Yorkie size and weight. It's very uncommon, however not impossible, that every now and then a purebred Yorkie will be born that is much, much larger than expected. In many cases, there can be another breed, unbeknownst to the owner, mixed into the bloodline, despite being a registered purebred. The American Kennel Club guidelines state that a pedigree of three generations is required for a dog to be classified as a purebred. This means that going back five or ten generations can be a larger dog that accounts for your large Yorkie. Factors that can affect your Yorkie's rate of growth Genetics As with humans, genetics play a huge role in how your Yorkie grows. If your Yorkie was procured from a breeder, you should have received information regarding their parents. You'll be able to compare their measurements and get some sort of general idea regarding how your Yorkie might grow up. Diet 
Your pup's diet will have a huge effect on the shape of their body. Not only will it determine their size, but certain ingredients can have an effect upon how the bones will grow and their overall health. You should always make sure to feed your Yorkie a high-quality kibble like Merrick's small breed recipe and offer nutritional snacks like Nuttervet Vita Pet Puppy Daily Vitamins. Exercise Any dog requires exercise, but Yorkies have considerably high energy levels and can be expected to stay active throughout the day. It's recommended that you should take your Yorkie on at least two 30-minute walks every day. Medical Conditions if after your Yorkie's fourth year they are still continuing to gain height, they could very well be suffering from acromegaly, a condition concerning pituitary gland issues. The Yorkie will be releasing too many growth hormones, causing them to continue to grow beyond a healthy size. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.